What's your opinion of the state of rap music right now in Memphis? Um, I, I feel like it's too serious, it's too straight, not, a, not enough fun. So I, I feel like, uh, you know, that I'm making it pathway, saying, wow, like, is you can make any kind of music coming out of Memphis. Now, give me a tour of the city of Memphis. For someone that's never been there before, let's start with the food. Favorite food spot in the city? Uh, I like pizza, man, but Beard Street has wonderful barbecue food. You know, uh, Memphis is known for barbecue, so Beard Street is absolutely the number one spot. You, you'll want to touch down when you hit Memphis. Now, what, what do you usually go for when it comes to barbecue? Just curious. Um, I like, I like barbecue chicken. If I get barbecue, I get barbecue chicken. I like, I like chicken. <laughs> Now, how old are you? I'm just curious. I'm 22. Oh, 22. Okay, cool. Well, let me ask you this. Um, the nightlife in Memphis. Um, favorite nightclub in the city? Um, it used to be a club called K2, man. You know, I'm a promoter, so I used to do a lot, a lot of parties at K2. Um, even the big homie, Big Jook, you know, from CMG, he threw a lot of mansion parties there. So K2, I would have to say, it's a, you know, it's, it's very nice inside, you know. It's very, very nice. So I have to say this, but it's no longer, you know, I man, I, I've been traveling so much that I have to say dreams because, you know, when I'm strolling down my, my TL, they be having a lot of events at um, a spot on Winchester that's in East Memphis called Dreams. So I have to say dreams, man, is now what's popping in Memphis on Winchester. Now, what about strip clubs? Oh, uh, man, I, I don't really go to the strip clubs. I don't like really, you know, that's, that's not really my cup of tea, you know, but Pure Passion has been around for a long time. That's in Whitehaven. Aside, okay, so we talked about the food a little bit. We talked about the nightlife. Someone first time in Memphis, what else would you recommend they see or do? Bill Street. It's a must. You go on Bill Street. Uh, that's the heart of Memphis, man. Blues, barbecue, people, friendly people. Bill Street, most definitely. Anything else? Oh, yes. Um, Civil Rights Museum. That's from Martin Luther King. You know, uh, Elvis Presley. You know, this is the home of Elvis Presley. You know, you got the... Graceland, um, the Grizzlies are here. It's the home of Our Heart Memphis. <laughs> you have a lot of things, man. Memphis is Memphis is very powerful, you know. Like Martin Luther King, this is was his last stop, Memphis, Tennessee. So that's a big powerful thing, of course, Elvis Presley. You know? Now, what about the lingo? You know, every city has their own terms or phrases that someone would hear distinctly in that particular area. What I think would Memphis, someone hear in Memphis? Bruh and man, cuz. <laughs> Bro, man, cuz, fool, <laughs> yeah, stuff like that. I see. What does main mean? Man, it's a, it's a, it's a dude. Man, like that's 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 like you saying just like uh, like a like a man, like a like a a, a male. Man, but people call girls man. Man, stop playing, man. When you say man, you are serious. That's a man, man. You are serious when you say man. <laughs> now let me ask you this. What about as far as events? You know, like in New Orleans, for example, Mardi Gras is a big, huge deal out there. Is there any yeah. any big, huge? We deal have uh, African in April. You know, where we we get to learn a lot about our culture. You know, they they bring out all kind of bees and all kind of clothing and music and you know. And we also have Memphis in, in May. You know, where it's di diverse. African April. You know, Africa in April, but um, and it's all uh, downtown. Memphis in May is like a music festival man it's amazing all kind of big artists you know from Wale to Wiz have been um, you know at the at the at the Memphis in May they have barbecue f uh, fest they have Halloween contests you know so it's a big deal because it's, it's all about music you know and connecting so Memphis in May and African April are have two big had, events have you had a chance to perform at Memphis in May yet no because I you know <laughs> I just popped off so <laughs> when it when it come around I know I'm be on this stage going crazy so is that something you're looking forward to? Yeah, ab part? absolutely. I'm always looking looking forward to performing uh, for the people in my in my city. You know, absolutely.